Hi, Denise Jordan here, and I have more news for you from Makeup on Aisle 64. Today is just kind of a laid back, kick back kind of day. It's actually Sunday. My sister who was here visiting from Atlanta, Georgia was over, and we had a ball playing with all my makeup products. It was just like playing makeup when we used to get into my mom's Fashion 220 stuff. So we really had a good time. And this is a look for today that I ended up doing as a result of just kind of fooling around with all those products that I had. I hadn't tried my Tyra Banks tie, four minute tie over yet. So I thought, well, let me just try that for today's video. So here's the look. Get these glasses off so you can see my eyes. Now I kind of like it. I think I achieved a pretty good effect. It's nice, it's soft, it's great for Sunday. The eyes are a little darker than I normally go. And as a matter of fact, this is the eye pencil. It's called Eyes in a Stick. And when you look at it, you can see that it is dark, but I got it on and I blended it out with a brush. You're supposed to blend with your fingers with this tie over line, but I'm still struggling with all of that. Um, so I used a brush to blend it out and I finally was able to get it blended out enough that it worked for a nice daytime look. Um, the other thing that I'm wearing is the cheek and a stick. And I really like it. It's kind of a nice rose color and uh, it goes on very well. I thought it might be a little too bright, but it wasn't. One of the things though that I do have to remember, and if you get this, you'll have to remember to do is go on with the light hand and then you can build it up as you need to. And then you just blend it out with your fingers. And I was able to get that blended nicely with my fingers. So I'm pleased with that. The um, sculpt in a stick, is this one and it's the bronzer and this bronzer looked a little dark I was a little concerned about that so I just kind of dabbed it on you know making the funny face that kind of thing and then blend it blend it blend it and I finally had to get out my brush to do the blending so that it wasn't too deep for me um, so that's how that one worked and then this last one is the highlighter it is called Light in a Stick Highlighter, uh, Sensational City, and this is the color, and it is nice. I put it on, on my, you know, just in the cheekbone area, a little bit in the brow area, and I really like it. I think it really came out very nicely, um, you know, bridge of the nose, the chin area, that kind of thing, and I like it. So that's the Tyra 4-Minute Tie Over. You get this one, which is the... Um, Light in a stick, light in a stick, cheek in a stick, contour in a stick, and then eyes in a stick. And they went on pretty quickly. I did get it done a lot quicker than I do my normal makeup routine. Now, what am I wearing on my lips? I am wearing a Sonia Kasha, which is this one. And the color is Current. And I thought it was very interesting that I managed to pull out a lipstick and a cheek color that were very, very close in color. So they really worked very well together. So all these products that I've been buying have been paying off. So there's that. Now, what else came in the collection that I ordered with that Tyra Banks Beauty line was this mascara. And it is called Smack My Fat Lash. And when you take a look at it, this is the kind of applicator that it has. And if you look at that, it looks kind of blue. So I'm looking forward to trying that, but I didn't want to try it just yet because I've got about three mascaras open right now and I don't like to have too much product open at the same time. And then this one, which is called Oops, you've got your um, eraser on this end and then your eyeliner on this end. And I tend to have Oops an awful lot. So this will come in pretty handy. And then, of course, you got this little cute little makeup bag when you ordered off of a HSN when I ordered it. Yes, it was HSN. I know I am supposed to stay away from Home Shopping Networks and QVC and all of that. And I tried. But I had been wanting to try some of the Tyra Banks line. And when I heard she was going to be on HSN, I couldn't resist. So I ordered that. But I'm, I'm trying to do much better and stay away from Home Shopping Networks. 
stay away from Ulta and all that. We'll see how it goes. So that's it for now from Makeup on Aisle 64. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Share the love and share the link by sharing with your friends that you think might like this video. And by all means, subscribe. Subscribe to my video and subscribe to my blog. I'll have more news for you later from Makeup on Aisle 64.